how many pages? Okay, so we did this, we did this, we did that. Uh, we did, we did not do this. Region locked arcane only run. What do you guys think about that? What would an arcane build look like? Because I've, I, I, I mean, maybe, maybe. You can go Reduvia, I guess. The best nut ever. 300 to 400k channels. Oh, yeah, 100%. This is going yeah. too far. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I know I had to like request or, or whatever. Stubborn Slowpoke, thanks for the brand new Prime sub as well. Okay. Uh, should we... Let's get a timer up. Arcane. So, so, arcane only. I guess that literally means we're gonna only level arcane the whole time. I guess that could be kind of cool. We're li literally just gonna only level arcane. <laughs> Watch arcane on stream. Yeah, have arcane in the top corner. I actually, I haven't watched that show entirely. I watched the first few episodes and it's really good, but I just, I guess I never got around to it. Uh, this, ah, there we go. Okay. <clears throat> Who requested this? Arcane only region lock. Okay, RL means region lock, in case anyone's wondering. Okay. So let me, do, I'll, I'll change the title. Um, oh my god, the longest title ever. Okay. Making a TikTok? I actually do have a TikTok. Uh, let's go ahead and delete... Definitely not 100 Punch Man. I guess, I, like, I have save files for all this stuff. Man, I have a lot of runs going. What is this run, I wonder? Oh, this is the level 1 plus 0 routing run. What else have we got? Not sure what this one is, so... Surely it's fine I delete this. Suffering was level 1 plus 0, NG plus 7. <laughs> we need that as a copy pasta. Okay, so arcane only. So let's go ahead and start with the highest arcane class. I feel like that's appropriate. So 14 on the bandit's probably the highest. So yeah, this this is from the charity stream, the charity like long week stream we did. Um a few months ago. Kill all merchants. I'll probably do that as a separate run. I think that'd be funny to just like run around killing merchants or something. Like, I feel like daggers in this game kind of suck, but I haven't used them enough. Yeah, we got the regalia. That's true. I'd rather use a weapon I haven't used before, though, because I did know hit the game with that. I'm sure you could, like, probably reduce that link to just remove the slash video part. I'm gonna try to kill Scion with this, I guess. See if this does any work. Should be a decent repose, though. No? Nope, I guess not. One, two. Here we go.
<laughs> Worthless repose, yeah. Welcome to Elden Ring. Where the reposts are garbage and the bosses are worse. It really made bleed builds kind of like, or, or like fast hitting dagger builds. I feel like they're just, oh, for fuck's sakes, I can't die. I don't know, like the, the bleed builds that were good in DS3 are not good in this game as much, I think. But bleed, bleed builds are good. Oh, what the fuck? Well, that sucks. I've actually never really, I've never really used the Reduvia before, so we can definitely go with Reduvia. Yeah, I threw for content. Surely, that's what I did. Got hit intentionally, threw for content. As I do. <laughs> so what else is good with Arcane? Like, is it literally just... Let me search up a list here. Arcane. I want to see a list of arcane weapons. I guess the like any weapon could be good with arcane if we put an, like an occult fusion on it. Maybe I shouldn't go only arcane leveling because I don't really have a ton of decks. Although like. I, I kind of want to, though. I kind of want to only level Arcane. Ripple Crescent? What is that? Yeah, we should only level Arcane. That'll make it more fun. Don't say Fextrid. How dare you say that? Oh, the frog guy weapon. You also have Kukri's. Okay, so how do I get the frog weapons then? Surely I don't have to farm that, right? Surely. Oh, from... Idea. Okay, okay, that's what we'll do then. So she sells one of the frog weapons? Okay. Different weapon. Oh, yeah, it is region locked. Um... I don't know, maybe. Let's go get the Reduvia though first. But, uh, how much dex does Reduvia need? Probably more than I have. Have they served you? I can play turning to eight you need to the foot. Then it's summon. Yeah, it, it is region lock. Oh, it's 13. That's perfect, dude. Region lock meaning, in this case, that we can't leave the region until we kill the main boss of the area, of course. Dragon Claw. Well, spells, yeah, like we could use incantations as well, but they're probably gonna. Like, yeah, we can use incantations, but obviously we would need the right arcane scaling seal with that. Which I, it, what, the Dragon Communion one's the arcane one, or. Uh, Navinate's the one who requested the run. Maybe I should say that, <laughs> but. It's 
a funky. Dragon Community. That, that's the best arcane one? Yeah, I guess we can go grab it then. I don't know. Fit the theme of the run. And then, yeah, we could do some incantations like Catch Flame then and stuff. Although I feel like Catch Flame isn't very incantation, but or isn't very arcane related. Oh, no, no, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to send him home, dude. I need to kill him. Yeah, let's just try to, like, maximize our use of status effects, I think. Okay, how do I kill you with a dagger? Oh, boy. How did that <laughs> not parry you? Get the fuck out of here. Narragus. What is this? How is that not a backstab? So the strategy of simply let your summon do everything. It's a strategy we're employing. Oh, you thought you were healing on me, dude. That's what he thought. Okay, uh, literally all me right there. All me. Wow, right at the gate we can use that. Okay, perfect, dude. Okay. Uh. Nice, dude. So we'll use the Reduvia in this region. That's a good idea. We'll use a different... We'll use a different... Um... How do I indicate arc request? Is that intuitive? Requested? <laughs> or, or not? Rage quitted. Is that what RQ means? Is this okay? I don't want it to be like a whole paragraph on, on there, so... Expecting a Twitch viewer to read. Well, my Twitch viewers are of higher intelligence than the average, so. <laughs> what kind of fucked up song? God damn it, dude. Do we go get ourselves a plus one Reduvia? Let's just fucking do it. Right down the road. <laughs> and so, yeah, we're lit only allowed to level up Arcane. That's it. Can't level up anything else. How's it going, Hemlocks, by the way? How's it going, dude? You, you there. Could you help us out, Kali? Navinate is the requester. <laughs> yeah, surely, Potato. That's... Whoa! Wow, that would have been a horrible death. Let me out. Alright. Uh, it counts as a hit. Yeah, but we're not doing no hit at the moment. Of course, I didn't go to upgrade yet. Yeah, we'll use buffs as long as I can actually cast them. 
this way tarnished. What? Okay, you guys have to think. So when we get into Lyurnia, that will allow us to. I guess is is there? There's not really any great crafting, I guess. But yeah, once we get into Lyurnia, then we're gonna switch to that axe, I guess, right, or whatever it is that the frog axe. But then, what do we use in Altus? Because we're gonna, yeah, that's a good, that's a cool idea to switch our weapon every region. Oh, the pole blade, yeah, that's a good, that's a good point actually. Can I wield that? Or the Helis, yeah, that's a good, good one too. I've never actually used that one, so I'll probably go with that. It just, uh, it's just a matter of being able to actually wield the weapons, though. Oh my god, hello. Just smack me out of midair. The all hit run is what we're doing. Nice one. All hit run. Maybe we should go get uh, the Alexander chart or Jar chart and the uh, and Golden Vow. Probably have gone to get that. I don't know for. Okay, Bloody Heal is 16 strength, 19 dex. So we're gonna need to wield that somehow. Also upgrade that somehow. Barry's bouquet. I've actually, I've already done a run with it a while ago. Yeah, the problem is we can't get the, we can't get that Kalid stuff until we're done Altus, right? That's the problem. Yeah, well, we're, we're, yeah, we, we should be fine though. Got this, the uh, tears. And then we'll have Godric, so should be fine. Is the Albinorc mask like a pickup or is that a a drop? RNG drop. Two Reduvias? Not without going online and getting somebody to drop it for you. Oh. Get blasted, dude. Easy. Nice. Okay, let's uh, go get the jar shard now. Our boy's got to be killed, unfortunately, for him, not for me. Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, uh, so yeah, right now, for people who don't know, right now we're doing uh, a, a couple months ago, probably like 
two, three months ago, we did a charity like marathon and people who donated got to pick a run for me to do. And that is what we're doing. Goodbye, bastard. There's something very satisfying about this Ash of War somehow. Not sure what it is. Yeah, get shit on, dude. We could also go get Blue Dancer at some point, but... Like, let's go get the Physic and all that stuff. Kill Alexander without talking to him first? You, you cannot, no. Not, not here, at least. You can kill him later without talking to him first. A waterfowl out of nowhere. Yeah, I hate when that happens, dude. The waterfowl out of nowhere. Classic. Let's go, Lucy. Welcome back. You guys think I should use blood pots, really? When I when we tried them on the consumable only run, they were kind of like I guess I, I didn't have high arcane or anything, but they seem pretty underwhelming. I, I I think I just didn't have the right setup though. We could maybe try them. Maybe we should also try to go get the bleed mask. What chair do I have? I honestly have no idea. Just some chair from Staples that I don't know anything about. I just bought it, and I didn't really think too much about it. Actually, are bad? Okay, well. Oh, yeah, I guess St. Trina's Sword, we could use that. I don't know if it actually scales the damage in Arcane, but... Okay, so we got the Physic. Did I get a plus one, or did I forget? I totally forgot to get a plus one. Maybe, maybe... I went to the I'll church, the and I just totally not did not grade. <laughs> Yo, Gata, thanks so much for the 26-month resub. Still doing the most insane shit I see. Very nice. Hope you're well. I appreciate that, Gata. Yeah, I hope you're doing well as well. It's nice to see you here. You there? I oh, Trina scares with in, huh? The God, you'll breach the... Well, but of course. Yeah, OG viewers, dude. The gates. Except it's actually the opposite. I think I, I watched Goddess stream probably before I even streamed at all. I think. Uh, let's go ahead and... I, I would like to mid-roll or fast roll. No, oh my god, how did I not die? <laughs> That's actually insane. Wow. I don't know, I, I have such a horrible habit of blocking there. You definitely, what you want to do there is just run and jump, but not do the block cancel so that you don't get <laughs> totally blasted like that. Yeah, we so we have here. I, I think there's a link if if you guys do exclamation mark charity, it should link you to uh Forget like the page. It seems torrent, whereas I may there is and so I think gather. you guys can see all the all the runs that were requested. Let my hand. Like there's a lot, man. There's a lot of runs, man, that we gotta do. Like this is the first page, I think. And we've done two. Or three. We've done three. And then there's like probably five pages, so we'll get as many done as we can. But yeah, this was from like uh, the charity stream like three months ago or so. Charity week stream, I guess. Week long stream. How's it going, Tiger? What's up, dude? Let's get the, we'll get the dagger just so I can put 
Golden Vow on there. I did get a plus one, so let's go into here. Oh, did I did I mess up? No, I did, that's fine. Like, I guess it's not perfect, but it's good enough. Is it this guy who dropped a somber too? I can get him. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. This is going too far. He's not bleeding. Oh, Gina. Here we go. Uh, Elijah, thanks so much for the five month resub. Wow, that's insane. Oh, that's not fast enough. This guy's a... How's this guy not a boss fight? <laughs> He's insane, dude. that somber two. Oh my god it's a somber one <laughs> that's so stupid well i was scammed probably everyone in the chat was saying like it's not a somber two it's a somber one that whole time that's what i get go around here. No, it's it's not time wasted. It's fine, dude. It's fun to just play the game normally sometimes. I'm going to get my revenge on the Scion. Surely this will go well. And I'm not even getting the grace first. Wow. Okay, I... <laughs> White flag is up. I'm leaving. I'm sorry. I'm out of here. I'll go, I'll go back later. I don't remember... Does that guy even drop anything? I don't think so. Clearly, I need more heals and stuff. Golden Vow, and we can only level Arcane, so... Let's go ahead and do that. Only Arcane. Number two. You and I can also that you're not then why I am Carly. Why am I talking to you? Bye. All right, there we go. Rivers of blood. I guess we could use it. Yeah, we could use it for the the mountaintops area. Not a bad idea. Uh, let's go that cool route that we were doing. Is there anything else in Stormvale that will be useful for this? Oops. 
Well, the pole blade will be for Altus, right? If, if I'm actually going to even use it, but we could, yeah, we could use the pole blade for something. Um, like, I guess it doesn't have to be that the weapon is in the region that we're, go that we're going to. What's this again? Oh, right, the feathered arrows. Uh, I've been doing runs, Godless, in... I've done a lot of runs in Dark Souls 3 and Dark Souls 2. But I, I've done, like, no-hit runs in every FromSoft game. Or every every Souls game. Or Sekiro, I guess. Souls born Akira. As people like to say. Already used it? Oh yeah, you're only allowed one hit per arcane weapon. I forgot about that. Only only one hit per arcane weapon, then you have to switch. No, just whenever we're in Limgrave, we have to use the Reduvia, and then we'll have like a... a different weapon per region, I guess. Yeah, we're gonna get that like ripple blade or whatever it's called. As soon as we enter Liurnia. <laughs> Scion. Yeah, we gotta go back and get revenge on that Scion or something, dude. Okay, let's see if this is an I mean plus two. Eh. Oh, I got landed on. I'll give you the best nut ever. This is going too far. Not horrible, but... Oh! Really? Steel, thanks so much for the nine-month resub, dude. Welcome back. Oh yeah, dude. Where's my repost? Oh, <laughs> that's devastating. Kind of blasting him. Easy. It's not bad. So the rules of this run, we're gonna do only leveling up arcane, only stat we can level. Um, and then we're also going to do it region locked. And then we're also going to do it only one weapon per region. So very simple rules, obviously. Yeah, that's not bad, dude. Considering like the setup, we have pretty bare bones setup right now. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Thanks for uh, so the insane 10 more that gifted subs, so dude. That's shit. insane. That is such a garbage. Thanks so much, Matt. Oh my god. Make sure you thank Matt, Matt if you got a sub from him right there. Or at any point. Well, we're just going to do, we're just going to do any percent, so we're probably not even going to go to Kaled, I don't think, but we'll see. It is fun to do these runs region lock. That's like, yeah, you know, maybe we should do all these runs like this instead. It'll make it more interesting. Unless, of course, the weapon is like far in the game, but. It just it's more fun when you're not getting a plus nine right away. So we're probably gonna do most of the runs like this then. What's up, uh, ankle socks?
And if the weapon is, if the weapon that somebody requested is, is far away, then we'll just go and like grab it and then, and then just come back into Limgrave. But I'll reserve the right to like change it slightly if, if we want to kill Redan instead of maybe, maybe Renala or something. Best not ever. This is going too but far. there are there are still a few things I would like to grab. So uh, we want to go get. I can, I'm gonna go get that arcane seal, and we'll use that to buff. Uh, oh boy. <laughs> Yol Yixa, <laughs> thanks for the brand new sub. I appreciate that. Okay, let's go to round table. I I think I think I said that pretty well though, to be honest. I felt pretty good about that one. Oh, oh yeah. Otter sore. Is that is that right? Uh, like combine the worst person at reading Twitch names with the most insanely hard to read Twitch names ever, and it's not a good. Uh, not a good combination, obviously. And get one of those. We want another stone sword key. Go get the seal. I'm gonna get that. Should we also get catch flame? I, I kind of don't really want to use catch flame. I'd like to just stick with status effects. Oh, welcome, if I can. And explore so that one ensuring either way. Even though we can make good use out of catch flame, even with the arcane build. Maybe, maybe. I'll pick I'll it up. Best not Never ever. know. The... This is okay. going too far. <laughs> Gabriel, thanks for the nine month resub, dude. Welcome back. Okay, let's go get the seal. Yeah, the rot rapier could be useful. Mm, I should probably spend these runes before we... Because I'm not going to... I guess we could kill the boss here. Should we kill the boss here? I guess we'll do it. I wouldn't mind taking out this chariot before we do it, though. I could do. Like, how is, does that happen? <laughs> like, it's so stupid, dude. Yeah, Elden Ring backstabs where you are directly at the back of an enemy. You whiff the backstab. And then after all that, you're in a two hour backstab animation that. That you just basically guarantee get hit out of. Uh, Thralls could be blood in DS3, yeah. I think so. I'm gonna go ahead and use this, I guess. Surely not a waste. How many of you guys came into this dungeon early and just got totally blasted by everybody?
I did. Because obviously, like, it's the first thing you see. It's the first stone sword statue. You have to go into it. Come on, buddy. I started with the stone sword keys on my first playthrough as well because I was thinking like This is going too far. I was thinking uh I don't know. Hello? And only you only walked straight into the explosion and didn't die <laughs> i i guess it's because i i think i'd normally shoot the ones on the side shuby jones thanks for a gift note to sub thanks so much dude i usually shoot the one on the side so the timing was just slightly off but i i really like this dungeon though i think it's really cool Except for these one million enemies. Wait, can you teleport in this dungeon or something? Why don't I have the trapped thing? I'll just grab it and run, I guess. You, you can fast travel in this dungeon? Whoa. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best. Oh, I guess I'm not fighting the boss, you guys. <laughs> I, I had no clue. This is going too that you can fast travel out of here. Brimstone Reaper. Thanks so much for the brand new Prime Star, dude. That is insane, dude. I can't believe that you can fast travel out of there. Maybe, maybe. I'll give also, you did I just pick up the wrong ever. item? This is going too far. Ah, <sighs> I can't believe I've done this. Maybe, maybe. I'll At least this guy doesn't respawn. Ever. Dude, I, I clearly did this intentionally this so that far. I could pick up those poison bow darts again. Lord PTK, thanks for the four month prime sub. And Pen Jame, thanks for the three month prime sub. I can't believe I've done this. I do like this dungeon though, and I cannot believe I didn't know I could fast travel out of here. That would have been probably very useful for something. What grease did I get? Dragon wound grease? Because now I'm wondering like the, the times I lost runs to this dungeon from the chariot, could I have just fast traveled out? Or did I have enemies aggroed on me? Or maybe you can, maybe the chariot counts as like an enemy that's aggroed to you. And so you can only fast travel out once you get rid of them or something. All right, dude. I get it. You can teleport. Second time's the charm. Okay, and we can wield that right away. Boost Dragon Communion Incantations. When did I find out? Uh, well, it was obviously off after my All Bosses run. <laughs> so, um, I think it was like pretty soon after my All Bosses run. Where I learned that you can just drop down. Oh, dude, we hit 50k followers as well, by the way, you guys. Insane, dude. 100k and 50k. I don't know if it's in the same day, but it's pretty close. Crazy, dude. 
Yeah, thanks so much, you guys. Well done. I'm gonna kill this boss to get access to the Dragon Communion stuff over there. Yeah, I'll probably, I, I definitely should do a YouTube stream soon. What is this on the ground here? Why is it weirdly lit up? I wonder if this will actually reach him. Come on, Reduvia. Work with me. Nice. Where's this enemy? He's not here? Oh. So the reason, we figured this out yesterday, the reason why you want to kill those guys is because if you don't trigger them, then the boss just stays sleeping. Which is kind of cool. Not that it's really necessary, but... Get out of here. Monkey man. we go. I remember, yeah, I remember my first playthrough thinking, how on earth am I going to no hit this boss on all boss no hit? <laughs> That's what I remember thinking, which is pretty crazy considering how trivial this boss is for no hit at this point because you just blast everybody. Like that was before I realized how broken you could get in this game, obviously. Because I was just thinking you just had to go in and just fight the boss, right? But obviously not. Ace Fireborn, thanks for the two-month resub. Thanks, dude. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best. If only there was swimming ever. in this game. Maybe there's going to be swimming in the DLC. This is going too professional far. idiot. Thanks for <laughs> gifting out a sub, dude. Thanks, professional idiot. Uh, I have it on my left hand just because it's simpler to use Golden Vow on my right hand, I guess. Okay, so we have the Dragon Communion. Let's see what options we have. I guess we get more... Like, uh, these faith requirements are something... We'd have to get the Faith Talisman to use some of this stuff. Like Dragon Claw we can use, and Dragon Fire we can use. Do we try him out? What do you guys think? It could be cool. Let's go kill the dragon. Oh, nice, Link. Is, is it, like, actually a, a really good weapon, or is it more just you, you're using it because you like it? Is, is a Gil's fire better than just standard dragon fire? More damage left... Is that is that a Gills that's less range or is it the other way around? It should be good here, I would assume. Oh yeah. Half HP before we can even do anything. Dang. Perfect.
Wow, dude. Easily. Nice. Okay, let's see which which one do we get. We're not gonna be able to cast it quite yet, but we're about to head into Liurnia anyway, so. Wait, do we not get a Gil's Flame already? Or do you have to go to the Kalid one for that? We can just we can just go with Dragon Fire. I I have used Dragon Claw quite a bit, and it's pretty good. Wouldn't mind both of these, to be honest. Maybe we'll get both. So let's just get Dragonfire for now. And let's go into Liurni, I think, right? So so what's the weapon we should go and get for Liurnia then? Oh, right. We're going to... Or maybe we should... Wait a second. Maybe what we should do is get a weapon from this area and then use it for all of Liurnia instead. <laughs> And then use the ripple axe for like the next area and so on. So maybe if we do that. Are there are there any other good arcane weapons here? Like we can get the regalia here, I guess. Yeah, true. We can just use like spells, maybe. But let's think. If we're going to kill Renala. Yeah, Regalia is not great. It doesn't even have status on it. I don't think using spells is the best idea. Dang it, dude. I should have saved the Reduvia. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I can, can I? Oh, is the clinging bone a arcane weapon? What's up, Chris? Does it do any status effect? Oh, the claws. Yeah, maybe we should use the claws here. Probably not a bad idea. We could go get the claws. That should work well for Renala. Although it's not really an arcane weapon, though. What what's the uh, what's the knife that allows you to put the occult infusion on something? Is that the one that's is that the black blade or whatever? Like really far into the game? Yeah. Dang, dude. What do we do? Going with the regalia would literally be just like the worst weapon possible because it's magic. Yeah, we could blood infuse. Yeah. So I guess that's what we'll have to do.
And yeah, maybe we could try to use Dragon Ma. We could go with spells, dude. I kind of already bought the flame, though. I would just be concerned about FP, though. Okay, let's let's just go. Let's go get the Faith Talisman. That's probably the first thing. Faith Talisman so that I can use these spells. And then we can probably go with like a spell build here. Too bad the fire tier is in Kayla though. It probably does, King. Yeah, I think so. Oh my god, what is that emote, dude? That's great. Yeah, let's definitely go pick up Blood Flame Blade. So I guess we're going to be using incantations here then. Is the Dragon Communion Seal somber, by the way? Okay. Yeah, we can get it to, like, plus four, then. We should also probably go get the faith tier, then. Maybe. What the hell was that? Miyazaki care package. I guess technically the bubble spells require arcane. So we could go with the, the frog staff, but it's pretty bad though. And you some arcane based spells <laughs> you actually got hello fresh no dude it's not like that it's like the opposite what's up uh, Ronaldo? okay so we can now use dragon fire blasted it's just the, the problem is it's not a very fp efficient spell though <sighs> we like football slash soccer um i don't mind it i don't really watch it though I don't mind it. What have I done? Uh, get wrecked. Thanks, dude. We are doing arcane only. We can literally only level up arcane. We're also doing region locked as well. And then, and then I'm also doing a new weapon every region. Or like a new build, I guess. Not even Canadian national teams. Nah, no, not really. I do remember watching like the women's in the Olympics though. A few times, but. Because like the women's team's a lot better relative they're relatively better than the men's team, I think. I don't know. Like, I remember them winning stuff. But the men's Canadian team, <laughs> like, they got in, I guess, though, right? Like, I remember they scored a goal. I, I don't know. <laughs> like, I really don't know, dude.
Uh, Leo, thanks for a stun by, dude. Oh, yeah, let's just fucking kill this guy. Oh, wait, I don't have a build for him, though. Shoot. I wish... Should have saved the Reduvia. Because I, like, I kind of didn't decide on the full rule set until now. Because I, I only have fire damage, so... Oh, yeah, hockey for sure. Yeah. Of course, I watch that. We're getting our, uh, our flasks built up a little bit. Yeah, we'll probably use the pull blade at some point. We just, I, I need to think. We need to th manage our somber stones a little bit here. Not really though, because we can just go get the bell bearings, so. And we're probably gonna want to dip into Kaled after Altus, I guess, right? So that I can get like flame grant me strength and whatever else is good in there. No. Get sniped, though. Uh, decomposing. What's up, dude? Yeah, Rot Breath also. I think Dragon Claw is going to be the, the strat. If we actually are going to be using spells through this area, Dragon Claw will probably be what we use. A beach volleyball. Volleyball is actually a good sport, though. Well, I presume. Oh. I am an old cotto here, perhaps. You. I, I, I've messed up greatly, you guys. So, we can probably buy this and just get a plus three. Yeah, since this weighs zero, look how look at the upgrade cost. Let's get ourselves a plus three. And... I just... Killing, uh, killing Smarag is going to be a pain in the ass with what I have. Is there any other dragon heart that I could get? I guess... Uh... Makar. Right? We're gonna have to kill Makar eventually. But catch flame on Makar sounds horrible. Okay, maybe I'm changing my build. <laughs> Let's go with a, a different build here, maybe. Let's go with the claws and bloody slash. That's what I'm gonna do. Because I actually haven't maybe, really used the spells yet, so. I'll give you the best we just ever. we definitely need to go with something a bit better here. This is going too far. Crap PLS, crap PLS, crap PLS. Crap PLS. Out. Uh, Vuors, thanks for the... Whoa. Thanks for the two-month uh, Prime sub, dude. Welcome back. go hook claws and I guess should we go with blood flame on them blood flame hook claws is what we'll do so they don't actually have any arcane scaling innately but I get the bleed build up wood so That's what we'll do for here. Upgrading. No, no, no. We're only we're only leveling up Arcane. That's the only thing. But I, I do have like the Faith Talisman here. Oh. 
could have just totally not gone the right direction. Uh, yeah, you can't you can't put bloody slash on claws. Back here. Okay, there we go. So let's go. I'm going to go kill this boss just so that or maybe we should get these upgraded first. Let's go upgrade them. But I'm going to kill this dragon so that we can get another dragon heart for or we can go kill Makar, I guess, right? Well, I, I don't know. I just I, I, I would like to use some spells at some point. Let's go kill Makar. Plus five faith. Well, we didn't actually level up though. Yeah, we could use swarm of flies, I guess. Although we'd have to kill Moog if we go there. The Magma Worm is in Kaled, yeah, so we're not going to go there. Plus five. <laughs> yeah, well, also, imagine getting Grafted Blade. Grafted Blade plus Godrix is plus 80 levels, and 70 of which are not arcane. But yeah, we are doing region lock. Which makes it more interesting. And we're probably going to do most of the runs region locked, I think. Or just, like, at least partially region locked so that we're not going to go and get some plus nine weapon right at the start and just blast everything. It's not really as fun to do that. Uh, BTTV is not... People use 7 TV now. That's the new thing. So if you do exclamation mark 7 TV, that's like the, the new new one. Oh, yeah, we could use a spear, dude. Except, but yeah, I guess we wouldn't actually be able to use it. Maybe if I use Grafted Blade, but I, I wouldn't even be able to use Grafted Blade, so. All right, let's go Makar. Speaking of Makar, he's going to get suspended and in, in like the <laughs> kill Makar on Avalanche. It's suspension incoming. That's what he gets, dude. Hardest weapon, no hit. No, Vike Spear would be fine. It's not a great weapon, but it definitely wouldn't be the worst. Halo Scythe is like. Uh, uh, holy damage for no hitting the game is very bad, right? You can also pick up some smithing stones here, right? There's some somber force. Or weapon class? Not really. Oh, did I get the octopus helmet? Oh my god, I actually did. Does this do anything special? I don't think I've actually even ever gotten this before. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. Dr. Punch Nuts. Thanks for uh, giving this, this up. too far. Thanks so much, dude. Wow, I can't believe we got the squid helmet, dude. Octopus head. I've, I've literally never gotten this before. Crazy. I'm not mistaken, there's a few stones here. Is there more than that? Runark's good too. The 
They're four. So yeah, this, this build should be good on Makar. Like, it should be great on him, actually. Even with only a plus five. Maybe, maybe we got Blood Flame going then. Should have nothing to worry about. And of course, we got the Squid it's Helmet for extra far. protection. Or seen Flower. Thanks for the eight month Prime sub. Welcome back. Another Somber Four. What are the what's the drop rate of? Oh yeah, we can we can go get some sleep pots. I think I picked up the crafting kit or crafting for it, so I would assume that's what that was there. Yeah, we can sleep them. That's a good plan. Zero point five percent. Oh my god, dude! My lucky day today. Does this guy react to Kukri's? I've never actually tried. Is it going Basma? Don't. Surely I'm not going to get blasted here. Okay, yeah, let's go get uh, the crafting kit. Said Kukri. Yeah, I was kind of just like baiting people to tell me how to say it. Flame cleanse me. Uh, for for this run, or are you just saying in general? I think flame cleanse me is pretty good. It's nice to have. Okay, I believe we only need one sleep pot this strat. I think it was one. What a waste. I don't know how I <laughs> how I managed to use that. Okay, here we go. Why did I wait so long to throw that? What a waste. I don't know why I delayed that. That was really stupid. Oh my god. Yeah, so this is a good terrain here. just like riding a half pipe up the wall. Oh yeah, that's just great. This is excellent. I'm surprised I'm even surviving hits here.
bleed. There we go. Oh god, achievement unlocked. That's <laughs> that's not great. Okay, there we go. Let's go kill Renala now. Zaziki, thanks, dude. Your script emo? <laughs> nice one. Ugh. Don't even ask what that is. <laughs> Imagine if these were like visible on the screen of the stream. I do not choose them. That's a blatant lie. You guys remember there's one video where somebody somebody did a media share request of some like fucking weird video. I, I don't remember what it was. <laughs> well, like I, I just I remember what it was, but I don't remember anything about it. Like some guy you guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and then like Hunter had to cut it out of the YouTube video. Because it was so disturbing. I, I, I can't even remember what the video is about, dude. I, I wiped it from my mind. It was something. I Like, I genuinely can't remember what it was. But I just remember it was really bad. And I was, like, watching the run again, and I was like, oh, yeah. That was in there. Oh, right, Hunter. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I just, I felt literally just sick to my stomach after that. The amount of like cringe and through the roof, dude. Through the roof cringe. I actually don't even know if Media Share is set up right now. Okay, here we go. Let's just forget about it. I don't even know why I remembered that, but it's unfortunate that I remembered. Oh god, why is OBS frozen? It, I guess that just happened. Okay, here we go. 42 arcane. Simply tank it. Scripted tank. Nice one. Nice. Oh, we're going to do any percent, Suzuki. 
Guess I could have picked up the dex tier. Might have been nice. But it, it, like all of our damage is bleed anyway, so. I don't think there's anything worth picking up in here. Get the golden seed, maybe. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. Oh, I didn't even it's know there were just far. fireflies there. I guess it's not really useful, but. Uh, Izzy, thanks for the two month prime sub. Welcome back. Yeah, this should be pretty a pretty good setup here, even though we're only plus five. Maybe we should have leveled up. But. I assume this will be a two cycle. Oh, dude, this is almost a one cycle here. Wow, that's wild. Oh my god, dude, if I just kept attacking, that would have been a one cycle. That's pretty insane. Yeah, almost, almost scripted, dude. Wow. It's only plus five, man. Crazy. Oh my God, we almost had just an insane kill right there. Wow. That is, like, ridiculous, dude. Weave thy night into me. Easily. Yeah, that is crazy. Considering, like, it's just such a bare-bones setup right here. We do have a lot of arcane though, but that's not even affecting our damage output. Yeah, we maybe I should just put region locked in here so it's easier to understand. Region locked. <laughs> it just keeps getting longer and longer. Here we go. I was going Geo. Okay, so we cleared out Liernia now. So what should we use in Altus? We have to think about this because there's a lot of bosses in Altus. Unless unless we're going to count the capital as a separate area, but I don't see why I would do that. Maybe maybe going to get Dragon Claw. Best not ever. Let's also go kill Loretta now. Too far. <laughs> GL Gino. Uh, Kendon, by the way, thanks for the two-month resub. Welcome back. No, this area, we're going to use the frog weapon, I think. Frog weapon. I don't know what the frog weapon is, but apparently we get it here. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's all good, Geo. The title has progressively gotten longer and longer as people don't understand the components of it. But it's not it's not anybody's fault except mine, basically. I don't really think it could get much longer than that. I guess any percent could be in there. I don't know. I, I don't... I It should, I think. Right, Fugly? Or maybe it doesn't. I don't even know. Yeah, we need like a whole biography of Navinate in there too. And... Different... We, we don't have even have included the different weapons per region. <sighs> yeah, we are swapping weapons per region. Just to make it a bit more interesting. <laughs> yeah, step-by-step -step guide, of course. Throw that in there. I'll get the golden seed, too. Only p blood, poison, and sleep. Does it does blood flame blade? Like, is that included in that? Yeah, this this will be a pretty bad fight. Bleed is bad. Fire is bad. It's not that bad though. I've seen worse. Oh my god, why do you just backstep all day long? Not bad. Oh, we have a 122k somehow. When did that happen? Out of the way, deer. <laughs> Dang, dude. Wouldn't elevators make the same sound as your door opening? Dude, that's kind of scary. And then one time you're going to be going up an elevator and then somebody's going to open your door and uh, it's going to be all over. At that point. Next HelloFresh order I dark sign. Well, <laughs> sure, I guess, but I'm probably about to level up. So, Ripple Blade. Interesting. All right, I guess. Is that a somber? Wild strikes.
Interesting. Smithing stone weapon. Um, okay, so let's start probably by going to get the bell bearing. I didn't even know this was a weapon, dude. Because, like, I've seen this in the shop, but... I'm gonna level up, so don't... <laughs> don't buy HelloFresh to make me dark sign like that other time. Fifty-two arcane. I think this makes sense to use against. Um. I think this makes sense to use in the in, in the Landell bosses because it doesn't have innate bleed, right? We kind of want bleed for fire giant and godskin duo and stuff. So we'll probably go with the keyless for. For who? I don't know. What's up, Recycleman? Or what are the runs for today? So, I'm gonna do as many as I can. Like, I'm not obviously not trying to like speed run this or anything. But if you do the charity uh, command, just exclamation mark charity, then there's a there's a big list of stuff. And I'm, I'm, I'm probably just going to go in order, so. Scavenger's Curve Sword. Could go with that. What infusion do I put on that? Just like a cult infusion? It's just getting access to the occult, uh, occult infusion is kind of a pain. Oh, put seppuku on it. Yeah, I could maybe do that. I wonder if it's better to use in Farmazula, though. Because cause Mountaintops only has one boss. Right? How, how Elden is the ring? How cock is the ring? That's a great question. Yeah, I don't know if, like, you you don't have to donate. Like, we're not doing the charity stream at this point. For people who don't know, we did the charity stream, I think it was like two months ago. Our charity marathon. And people donated to request runs for me to do. And that is exactly what we're doing at the moment. I did do a few of them, but there's a lot. So we're going to, like, slowly do them over time. So, like, I, you can probably still donate, I guess, but I, I don't even know if you can. It's probably closed. Condom no hit? Well, that's exactly what I'm not going to do. It's honestly just a horrible weapon for this boss, but... Oh my god, where's my roll at, dude? Die. Oh, I guess not. Dang. This guy's probably like a legend at Beyblade. Alright, so we're going to swap to this weapon for Altus then. Oh, I spent all my money, dude. God damn it. Why have I done this?
Yeah, I was so rich and I spent it all on Arcane, which we don't even need anymore. So I guess this is another one of those uh, smithing stone weapons that you just can't switch the Ash of War out on. It like, honestly, it makes these weapons a lot less valuable when they're like this because you're kind of, you know, the, the good thing about smithing stone weapons is that you can put Ash of Wars on them and, and then the Ash of Wars make the weapon extremely strong. But with these weapons, you're kind of missing out on all that and you're still having to use smithing stone upgrade path, which is worse. So. Worst of both worlds, yeah, basically. Well, the black wet blade is just since we're doing region locked it's very far away right i have to clear i have to kill morgot before i can leave to go into kaled based on region lock rules so it just kind of like it would be good but then i have to go kill Rodan, and i don't even really have to i would like to get ourselves a plus four or a plus 12 before killing the Draconic Sentinel, so... Obviously, we could just cheese him, but I don't really want to. I'm gonna need some money. How much, how much uh, does this Falling Star Beast up here give you? I'm also only... Pl I'm plus zero right now, so... Dude, 11k. It's a scam. Maybe, maybe we can just go fight the Draconic Sentinel with ever. like a plus three or whatever. Just get good, dude. This is going too far. Simply get good. Wet stairs. Thanks for the brand new sub. Thanks, dude. Simply get good. Loner stem. Thanks, dude. <sighs> More seeds. Or I guess, I mean, we've already got a plus three seal, which we could easily get to plus four. We could use that in this area, but I feel like that's probably not a good idea. Yeah, we need the seeds, dude, because we got to... I would like to use spells on one of these segments. I don't know when, though. I actually have no idea when I'm going to do it. Maybe I just never will use spells. Because I don't see when I would even do that. I really need to make an update for the game where if you're resting at a grace inside a cave, then you are able to fast travel out of the cave. Whoa, weird R2. Five Kukri. Uh, Ar Arcane does improve status buildup. I I would assume it does on spells as well, but I actually don't even know. Uh, I have played the remake, Seltan. Yeah, dude. I've no hit that game, actually. Yeah, I've done PvP in this game.
Oh, yeah, the seal. Yeah, we got the arcane seal. Do I have any money? I actually have nothing. <laughs> actually, just have to get good, I guess. Plus three. Let's go kill the Dracronic Sentinel. Do I have a, a VOD? I actually, yeah, I put it on my, um, my second YouTube channel. If you do ex exclamation mark socials, then it's like one of the links in there. Maybe we should, like, organize that command somehow. I just I just forget to pick up the maps, and I don't need them. Basically, the only way I have maps is if I cheat them in. Make a VODs command? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Probably should do that. <laughs> Dude, never delete 7 TV. It's required for the, the immersive chatting experience, dude. Actually, I actually am tired today for some reason. Not great for a 12 hour stream. Lots of gas left in the tank, though, you guys, remember? I've got at least 20 more hours in the tank. As we all know. I don't know why I'm going this way. Okay. Let's see if this does anything. Only plus three, so... Not really expecting much here. Ow! Oh my god, how did that not hit me? That was lucky as hell. Oh my god, how dare you do that? That was not ideal. I guess Blood Flame Blade is definitely not as good when... Oh god. Okay, I can't die this time. Definitely not as good when you don't have like innate bleed on something. We have wild strikes on this too. Maybe, maybe. 
maybe why did i use that and then i couldn't roll out of it <laughs> oh dude oh this is horrible why have i done this Uh, Peach, thanks for the seven month reset, dude. I don't know why I did that. That was so stupid. Oh, I, wait, no, I can wield a weapon. Okay, it's fine. I thought I couldn't wield it. Oh, it's only 11 strength. Okay, it's fine. We're all good. I thought I thought I couldn't wield it anymore. Whoa, it has such a weird moveset. And just realizing. Like the gargoyle axe in DS1 or something. This boss is such a downgrade on the other guys. the bleed surely will allow me to rebuff Whoops. Am I fast rolling? Maybe I'm not fast rolling. Because usually I just like go behind and strafe that. Like I did that like five seconds ago. Let me see if I'm... I might be fast rolling. Ah, I'm not fast rolling. I would explain that. You don't really need a fast roll on this guy, though. All right, surely whatever attempt this is the charm. Surely. I wish I could actually see how good this weapon is, but I have no runes, so I can't. We can't actually, like, put the proper upgrades into this thing right now. Oh, oh, come on, dude. Surely you're joking. This is kind of nice. I, I never get to really fight this guy properly. With the cheese. Have to rebuff at some point. When will you allow that? Surely you won't do it again. Oh, that's <laughs> so close.
See, that, that's what I was trying to do last time. Oh, dude, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, come on. I was not expecting that. Oh. I hate to see that. Well, yeah, the axe, is, the axe is worse than the claws because we have, like, we have less upgrades into it. And we're not really using, like, the optimal setup for it. I also forgot I might physic. Bro. I got I got quick slap smacked in the face. Yeah, do you guys think it is? Like, should I go get resin? Like, is that gonna be worth it on this thing? Cause I could go get it. I just didn't really want to like have to come back to this guy. I don't have any. Well, I could. I I don't have any rune arcs left. Go get a let's go get those lead greases, man. Let's go try it. No, I kinda just want to fight this guy. We can also get get the uh, charge attack stuff here while we're at it. Go see. <laughs> Fill the spammer. Yeah, I don't. I, I'm not a huge fan of the Draconic Sentinel. I think the other ones are more fun. He's still okay though. Yeah, we definitely don't. Uh, we don't really fight him properly too often. Uh, I, I, yeah, I sort of, I sort of fought him in the fist run. But then I ended up just getting the, like, golem to shoot him. <laughs> Knight's Cavalry is the best one. Surely, that's true. Like, is the weapon meant to do that much bleed buildup, or is it just... Is it just bugged or something? Like, I imagine it's intentional, right? Alright, we're gonna try the bleed grease. Well, yeah, but isn't it... I don't know. Like, isn't it specific to this weapon that the greases just do way more uh, build up? Or are there other weapons too? Yeah, this and the halberd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. I guess it's kind of cool.
I wonder, I wonder if you power stance this weapon with Reese's on it, how that would do. Okay. So I'm probably going to need a few of the, uh, these other things. Let's make like a few more. Yeah, you, you can go back, uh, Dr. Ma, into areas that you've already been. Uh, Brad, thanks for the raid, dude. How was your stream, man? Thanks so much, dude. But yeah, region lock allows you to go into regions that you've already beaten. Like, so that, yeah, that's fine. Okay, let's go try it now, I guess. I should have maybe gotten a closer grace. But I, I didn't expect to die like that. Oh, we're worldly plus three. We have ten vigor. Not great. How are the runs going, Brett? Uh, the closest grace is probably the cave. Or, or the catacomb. The catacomb's the closest one. All bosses? No, we're so this real estate we're just doing like any percent, so we just have to kill the main boss. So in the case of this area, it's like you gotta kill Morgoth. And then Godric is for Limgrave and Loretta is for Liurnia and so on. I actually have gens, yeah. I, I like I spent all the runes in Arcane. And I should have just saved a few so that I could upgrade more. Because I, I could be at a plus 12 right now. And then we'd easily, like, this would be no problem. But I kind of messed up. Okay, here we go. Let's see how much more bleed we're getting. Okay, there's our first one. Oh, he jumps off still. I just, I kind of just, there's no point in doing a weapon build if we're just gonna like cheese bosses, you know? Probably reapply some grease. Blood, bastard. Oh. Okay, I dodged it this time. That's what got me last time. Whoops, I didn't mean to roll twice. Could have re-greased. Huge mistake. Oh, Jesus, dude.
Oh, and I delayed it. Okay, it's <laughs> If he did the, uh... If he did the other one, I was probably dead. Like the fireball. But now, now his, like, bleed is just totally gone down, so I probably won't even proc him. For the kill. Wow. <laughs> That's insane, dude. That's insane. Guy's a menace, dude. Actual menace. Crazy how many different shield attacks they gave this guy. Like how many how many shield attacks can a boss have, you know? Pretty wild. There we go. Like seventh time the charm. Maybe okay, now I finally have some runes so I can go upgrade ever. this weapon. Finally. This is going too far. Uh, powerful, thanks for the eight month reset, dude. Welcome back. Yeah, it's been a while. It's it's just been a while since I've like fought that guy properly, so. It, w it was plus three, so not great. Um, yeah, we're plus three, so let's get those. We'll get these, and here we go. Plus twelve. Should be should be good enough. Except we're against Gold Free now, who can't bleed, but that's okay. 
of a Chalivan and where. Yeah, I can't I can't form my opinion on this weapon just off of that fight alone. Because maybe, maybe it is really good, but hard to I'll say. Be the best nut ever. Gordo, thanks for the brand new prime sub. This is going too far. Thanks, dude. I guess there's a rune arc in the capital that we can grab, so. Lanedale count as Altus. Uh, I think normally it's counted as different places, but Altus doesn't really have a main boss, so. <sighs> Elden Ring DLC has been in development since April last year. That would not be surprising to me at all, if that's true. Where do you where did you see that and from who? But yeah, that's that wouldn't be surprising at all, right? Like, you know, a couple months after or Yeah, like a couple months after the game actually released and they started making it, like that sounds pretty reasonable. So yeah, I mean it's I th I think it's probably pretty safe to say that it's gonna be a huge fucking DLC, right? <clears throat> probably gonna be huge. And we do we definitely need to make a character for it as well at some point, like not sure, I'm not sure what I'll do, but I would like to do a, a full casual playthrough of the game where we're just exploring literally every corner of the map again. Like, sort of like a second full playthrough. And then use that character for DLC. I, I won't go past, like, level 1... Probably 150. Like, so I'll be pretty powerful for the DLC, but... What's up, uh, Sahaj? Yeah, there probably will be a whole nother overworld. That's that's probably true. I'd be surprised if it wasn't that. Sort of like in Skyrim, how you have like Soul's Time and stuff. Like just get you boat to another island and then Yeah. Yeah, hopefully I I hopefully they maybe, um maybe I remember people talking a while ago that they were gonna add this they were going to add, like, far. a new weapon type or something. I don't know if that's actually true, but... I do remember people talking about that. Uh, Powerful, thanks for getting out a sub. Thanks so much, dude. Yeah, <laughs> please don't be shit. True. Yeah, I, I don't know what it would be though. Maybe, maybe. And I don't even know if that's true. Because they, they didn't do that for Dark Souls Three. They, they haven't done that for any of the games so far, where they this actually add a whole far. new weapon type to the game. You can definitely expect some new spells maybe, though. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. A uh, noisy Bowie. Thanks for the. This is going too far. Uh, thanks for giving out a sub, They'll and Sahaj, thanks for the two-month prime sub, dude. Welcome back. Uh, Godron 3, probably after the bingo. Donnie, I think. Hey, hopefully this will be serviceable for this fight. The AR isn't too bad, I guess. Not the worst I've seen, I guess. Oh, 
Not bad. Very interesting R2. That double hit. What's up, Sim Racer Tony? How's it going, dude? I'll spend a few levels, but not a lot. Yeah, the follow-up follow R2 is interesting. I don't know if that is good, though. I don't know if it's good interesting. But paid attention to the lore. East clergyman being Malaketh. Yeah, I guess it would be. Can you do this without Gambit? Oh yeah. That's nice. Okay. Who... I wonder, like, what setup... We're gonna have to think of a setup after this boss, because this is the last boss in, uh, for this region. I mean, should be good here. Oh, yeah. Ooh. That's, uh... Pretty rough damage, you could say. Done, maybe? Nice. I'd like to redo this. <laughs> Obviously, that's not safe to do, but. easy definitely that's definitely a good bleed build up for sure yeah we could use more got sword that's true but I, but I I have done a run with that already so although didn't they buff it recently I don't know if they did that or not we could try to use it Oh, is it 35 decks? Okay, yeah, well, <laughs> that's not happening then. That is not happening. Hello, Casual all great runes, bat roll. Interesting, okay. That's interesting. Okay, let's go get the bloody healers, I think, right? I wonder what's the actual fastest way to get there. I guess, I guess it would actually be from here. We could also go with the, uh, the pole blade, right? Doing a marathon? I guess sorta. Like I'll, I'll stream for at least 12 hours today. Maybe, maybe I'll give you I wouldn't really consider that ever. a marathon, but longer than a normal stream for the most part. It's going too far. <laughs> 50K on Twitch, 100K on, that's surely amazing, Mr. McElmay. <laughs> surely, dude. Uh, Dr. Mod, thanks for the seven month prime sub, man. Welcome back. Over buffed and then nerfed like Morgoth's greatsword. Interesting. 
It is a cool, like, it's a cool Ash of War. I, uh, there's, it's not, like, super useful in my experience, but... Um, I don't know. Maybe it was pretty good, though, actually. I remember the Renala kill with it was pretty insane. Yeah, I'm already tired. I don't know why I'm tired, though. Dude, I'm simply just conserving energy. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting old, man. Hate to see that. Okay, I do not fucking know this guy's moveset, so this will be interesting. Holy shit, I almost just instantly killed him. Oh, wait, I, I remember something. I, I would wait for him to go into that stance, and then I would, like, backstab him or something. Please don't blast me. It's probably one of my like least known movesets in the game out of all the bosses. Aha! Here we go. There's a lot of bleed build up, I guess. So 16 strength and 19 dex. So. Ooh, okay, wait a second. That's kind of a lot of dex, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe we need to visit Kaled. Maybe we got to go to Kaled, dude. <laughs> 18 dex. 19 dex. Maybe we should go to Kaled. What do you guys think? We should we can go to Kaled, kill Redan, and then grab the Source Seal. And then maybe maybe that's where we can finally use our spells. Physic? Yeah, I, I could use the Physic, but. Probably more efficient. But really, the only place I could actually get away with using spells is probably going to be in Kaled, so. That could be like our spell region. It might kind of suck though. Let's just do it. I mean, we're not in any rush, so. Let's go ahead and do it. So, yeah, we're, we will go with the spells for Kaled. Yeah, we'll get Rot Breath, exactly. Although, I have no Dragon Hearts right now. If we're using spells in Caleb, we could we could probably get away with using Black Flame on... Oh, wait, that's a lot of faith, though, isn't it? How much faith is Black Flame? Like, the just the spell Black Flame? No, I bought I bought one from Makar already. Yeah, it's twenty. So so we could hit that, I guess. Do we do I wonder if we kill him in three minutes though? Hmm. We can try... How, how FP efficient is this spell? Oh, the Source Seal. Obviously. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Oh, wait, no. No. <laughs> unless we... Unless we go underground as, like, a free area or something. It's like, oh, yeah, obviously the sword seal, but... No. We can get the scar seal. Uh, somebody requested it, Pamba. So we are doing a run where we can only level up Arcane. That's why I'm trying to, like, wonder about these levels here. And if we do want to get Rot Breath... Maybe, maybe... Then the I would have to ever. get Dragon Hearts for that. I could go back to... How many Dragon Hearts Guaranteed do you need ball. for it? Is it only one? For Rot Breath? Because I could just go back and... Kill Smarag with... The Claws. That would probably be pretty easy. Flix, thanks so much for the brand new sub. I appreciate that, dude. That's, is it only is it only one part? I, I think that's probably what I should do. Probably the best way to do it. All right, we're killing Smarag. Maybe we could also maybe, kill Exiles, but I'd rather kill Smarag. Best not ever. Not Simon, or is it? <laughs> thanks for the. Uh, this is going too far. Thanks for the uh, brand new prime sub, dude. All right, yeah, so the, the weapon we have for, for uh, Leonia is the Hook Claws, so that's what we're going to use. Uh, Yeah, it's the 58, Bill. And yeah, I still use it. Oops. Oh my god, I don't have... Well, yeah, but Grail, like, how, what do we kill Grail with? Like, what spell? Because the way... So the way we're doing this, by the way is um, we're kind of picking one build for each region and I have to use only that like weapon or build in that region when I go there. So so for example, in uh, in Limgrave, we, we, we use just the Reduvia and then Lyurnia, we've used just the Cook Claws and then it just is an extra way to make it a bit more interesting. And so in Kaled, we're going to only use spells, I think. No, we can use Rot. Oh, that'd be fine. Please don't tail swipe me. Yikes. Okay, this is going to suck. really can't hit the boss. A stun would basically kill you. Oh, you bastard. Wow, how could this be so difficult to do <laughs> with, with the claws? Used a lot of good weapons on these guys, and this is not one of them. How did that happen? This is this game is insane. Wow. This game is insane. I love fire deflection. What's up, Flippy? I think it's because of the terrain there and it, it deflected and got me. Oh, whoa. What can I buy? Oh, oh, because I didn't get it after killing Renala, dude. But yeah, you, you, yeah, maybe I should have went left there, I guess, but you don't really have to. Like, you can just go backwards. Let's go, Daphne. 
Wow, this is crazy, dude. What a horrible weapon for the dragons, though. I couldn't even imagine using this on maybe, on maybe. Uh, fucking. I'll give you the best name. Not ever. What's the guy's name, this dude? Going too far. X Ikes. Imagine using this on X Ikes. It'd just be painful. Uh, yeah, Dadby, thanks for the four month resub. Welcome back. If they just don't hit the boss. Oh my god, dude. What is even going on here? This is, ins <laughs> this is insane. Well, at this rate, I should probably just buy up every single rune arc that's here, man. I'm actually getting blasted by this guy. Surely I can survive a hit with armor on. What the hell? Of course you do that attack. You must be stunning. You have to. You have to stun here. Where is it? Why do you not stun? <sighs> what is that? <laughs> what even is that, dude? That is insane. <laughs> Oh my god. How is that even possible? I'm like, I don't even know if I've ever died to this guy before in my entire Elden Ring career. This is just wild, dude. This is wild. Like, I, I, I frame that, dude. But I guess it, like, I wonder. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what happened. It's like it's somehow roll caught. It, it, it caught me out of the iframe somehow of me getting off the horse, I guess. But I don't even see how. Okay, I'll actually win this time. No more horsing around, dude. Watch him tail attack and just blast me here. Okay, so he magically decides he's gonna stun this time, apparently. I don't know why, but on all those other times, he just didn't. It 
his head is in a position that I can't reach. Just insane. I can't believe this guy just wasted so much of my time. That's wild, dude. What an absolutely atrocious boss that is. Longest any percent run of all time right here. Uh, good luck, Daphne. Appreciate you uh, stopping by. We can use Flame Grammy Strength now, I guess. Should have waited for nighttime. I'm probably going to get blasted. Why don't we get this? How come when we use this Ash of War, it like, doesn't even do anything? Actually, I guess it's not bad, but it just it doesn't follow people. I want mine to follow people. Alright, we're gonna do this skip because everything's going so well today that clearly I'll I'll hit this. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay, so we can only use spells here. Oh my god, dude. This can't be real. Such a troll run so far. Scarlet Red. Uh, Dragon Claw? I don't think so. Probably the faster way to get here would have just been, of course, the, the trap chest, but too late. Saving runes for... I mean, I guess not. But we're, we're only allowed to level arcane, so... Uh, Neutron, thanks, dude. No, it's not Dragon Communion only. It's just, in this region, we're picking, like, a spell build. And then I think for the mountaintops area, which is going to be after this, we're going to go with the... Keyless, and then after that, I don't know. I have to pick something for. There's two more. I, I guess there's like there's two more regions after that, right? There's um, Farmazula, which has two bosses, and then there is just like Ashen Capital, I guess. Yeah, I guess Rivers of Blood could use for Farmazula. I'm not sure what we should use for the Ashen Capital, because that, that's probably the most important thing, right? We probably save, like, the best weapon we can for last. I gotta go get some water or something. I don't know why I'm so tired today, dude. It's actually insane. All right, Rotten Breath. We got it.
Uh, yeah, I guess we could use the pole blade for the the end part. Let's go like three seven, I guess. Surely, like, I mean, if I get hit, I'm probably gonna die anyway. So, and we'll go with probably. Let's go get another spell slot. What's up, Fistar? We're probably gonna. I'm probably just gonna go for like twelve hours or something. Nothing crazy, but. I'm gonna need some tea. Or something. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, massive, massive 12 hour stream, dude. Insane massive 12 hour stream. I can't believe we still have that rogue command in there. I don't think my code still works, but it might. Alright, time to go kill Radin. Radin. Three times the length? Well, <laughs> I guess so. Well, I, I used to, like, when I wasn't streaming as my full-time job, I would stream for so much longer than I do now. It's, it's kind of crazy. Yeah, hello fresh food coma, dude. That's what it is. Like, I would just stream for like 16 hours sometimes. But I'm actually I'm actually busier now than I was before, which is like kind of I didn't expect that. Okay. I'm actually busier now than when I was streaming basically full-time hours and having a full-time job. And I'm busier now somehow. It's, it's crazy. No, I, 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 I don't edit my videos. I have an editor. Hunter in the chat. I, you probably do have HelloFresh in EU, right? I think people are saying, I don't know, but it's basically like a, it's like a um, meal delivery service, but you make it, right? So they deliver the ingredients and then they have like the instructions and then you make it. So you could have like a homemade meal and have just all, all the ingredients prepped for you. And yeah, they, they sponsor a lot of streamers and stuff. It's really good. Like, I've been... Basically, every meal I've had this week so far has been HelloFresh meals. And it's the first time I've tried it. And, yeah, it's really good. And so, yeah, if you're in the U.S., you can get, like... You can get 50% off using my, uh... My link if you do HelloFresh. Or exclamation mark HelloFresh. Okay, here we go. Yeah, definitely for, for me, the best part about it is, is the fact that you're not like buying excess ingredients and then just having nothing to do with them, right? No, I, I, I think my deal only works in the U for like Americans or people in the US. Is this? Please roll. Oh my God. Okay, whoa, I survived. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Even though I'm not even American, but I guess it's just how it is. Why did I not bring Catch Flame? It's okay. We can use Dragon Claw. Cooler. Oh, and it kind of smacking him. No. It's slow as hell. I guess. God fucking damn it, dude. I'm just like leaking rune arcs all day here. Last rune arc. Is there a second claw attack, really? All these, like, some of these spells, I remember we did do a dragon. I don't remember why, but I did, like, a dragon incantation only run at some point, and 
it was it was actually kind of hard because they're just so slow. Maybe I can like bait out the running this one. Is this going to have enough range? the slowest spell of all time. Maybe we can use some dragon fire on him here. I just I guess I'll just do one. I don't even like when do I even attack him? Oh god. Ooh, okay. Maybe if he runs back towards me, I can do one here. Oh god. Whoa, <laughs> that's pretty funny. That's awesome, dude. <laughs> At the peak of, of his flight, we blast him out of midair. You know, I wonder what would happen if you killed him with Rot when he was coming in on the Meteor. What do you guys think would happen, dude? Would he just, would he just, we got to try it. If, so, if he procced Rot and then dealt, like, the perfect amount of damage where right when he started getting ticked by the Rot again, he just got blasted? No, 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 no. He's not invulnerable because there's, like, if you go back and look at that kill event, even, um, there's, like, a certain point where he starts taking Rot damage. And so, if he died at that exact moment where he's out of those iframes... No, you can go see. Like, I, I I, was literally watching his HP. As soon as he kind of loads back in, he starts taking damage. So you can probably kill him up there. Right? Okay. We continue. I, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just wondering. Like, maybe he just finishes his, his attack anyways and then dies, but... All right, so yeah, I guess we'll use the Helis then for the next area for Fire Giant. Yeah, he would he would have to. So I think the Rot did like forty four damage in a single tick, right? So you would have to get him. I mean, you could just test it with Cheat Engine pretty easily, right? That's what I would do. So, we could get this to plus 5, although I don't even think I need that. What's up, B-Money? This chat really does have the worst emotes, huh? That's probably true. It's just insane. Yeah, we can proc him with Rot. Set his HP to, you know, to 1 when he's in the air. And then as soon as he comes out of those iframes, then you get a proc and you just die. And I, I wonder if you just fall out of the sky. That has iframes on it, right?
Diddy, thanks, dude. Let's go on Hollow as well. Oh, yeah, too, that's true, Ronnie. Yeah, I guess you could just kill him. Not sure why I didn't just think of that. I just set his HP to zero. Honestly, wouldn't mind getting this Somber 6. Technically, we're still in capital, so... Except... Plus 11 Celsius. Uh, what's... Can someone do the weather command? I have no idea what the weather is here right now. Man, Wild Strike is actually crazy good. It's a Mad King. Plus eight. Yeah, for some reason, like when on the camera, it looks so much nicer out than it actually is, just all the time. It could be it could be raining and it'll somehow look like it's sunny out. I don't know how that works. I don't know how. But no, this is great weather. This is this is literally like my favorite weather right now. Perfect weather. So <laughs> yeah, that's how the green screen works, dude. The green screen. It's too bad there's not some sort of boss on the way to Fire Giant that's required just to break up the area or something. Oh, dude, it was, it was really hot. Um... Yeah, I guess it would have been last week. Yeah, it was, it was probably up to like 30. It's horrible. Well, it's, it's not, I guess it's not horrible, but it wasn't comfortable. And we were like moving a bunch of stuff outside too, so it was just roasting. Nile was required. Yeah. I don't know. There could have been just... You know what? Here's what I, I wish they did. And I wish they did this to, a, to different areas as well. If they... If they made it so that there was a shortcut up the mountain, maybe, but you had to kill maybe. a boss in order to I'll do it. Best not ever. I think that would have been really cool. I guess sort of like they far. do to ult this a little bit, right? Where you can basically kill Makar as a shortcut to get to not getting the medallions. If they did that, where you like went up the big elevator after killing some boss in the mountain, like it could have been, it literally could have just been the hero of Zamor boss that's here, right? And then you just take an elevator after the boss. That would have been so much better than having to just run all the way. Daddy Mop, thanks for the 22 month prime sub, dude. Welcome back. <laughs> What's up, Fixit? Thank you. I appreciate that. But that would have been quite cool. <laughs> yeah, Black Lake Kindred. But yeah, I mean, even, the, even that would have been fine. But. But yeah, there's like if if you think about the actual um like geography of this area, Fire Giant is right up there, right? He's he's just to the right over there. And the Here of Zamor Hero's Grave is right there. So when you think about it, there could have easily been an entrance, like some secret entrance over here that takes you into that dungeon. And then you can just go like the reverse way. So you can kind of just skip all the running section. But you got to kill a boss. So no hit runs probably wouldn't kill that boss. But if you're trying to go fast, you could. I think that would have been awesome, dude. Should have had me on the team at FromSoft. Making the decisions, dude. Clearly. Crucible Knight Duo would get you into lane down. Yeah, that, that could have been also like a cool idea. I, I think... The more ways to get around the map, the better. Yeah, fire Jimmy, hire me, dude, obviously. Um, and then um, I remember my first playthrough too, that there's a dungeon, but there's a tunnel in Weeping. This is sort of like a minor version of it, but the, I forget what it's called.
But you know the tunnel. The tunnel in Weeping. I thought that was going to be like a shortcut into the castle. Yeah, more in tunnel. I should maybe get these somber stones, actually. You idiot. <laughs> you absolute moron. Can I even get back up here? I can't even wield this weapon yet, so this is good. What have I done? In charge of combat design? <laughs> well, I, I don't think I would change anything about the combat in these games. Probably. I'd change stuff about the bosses, though. I don't know. You know who should actually be on the team is Couch Jockey. He should be on the team, dude. Couch Jockey's the guy behind the Converges mod. He should be on the team. Yeah, I totally forgot to grab the Source Seal. That's, like, actually the entire reason I went to Caleb. Uh, it's okay. I, I've killed beetles more slowly than this on the fist run. So it's all good. So we have enough for a plus seven, which is pretty good. And we can get a plus eight up here. Yeah, I'm very excited for a Converges mod, though. Which I think Couch said is going to be coming out, like the alpha version is going to be coming out pretty soon. It's always an Arteria leaf, dude. Yeah, so if you could if you could skip this bridge and go up there, because the yeah the hero's grave is right up there, dude. It just it was perfect. It was perfectly set up, man. For that. Really a shame. Oh no, I actually didn't even pick up the Somber 9 or the 8. So I just totally forgot about this. Uh, Converged Mods, a, it's an overhaul. Like a reimagining of the game. And it's made by people who know these games very well. Um... Which is pretty important, I'd say. <laughs> you work at FromSoft? Surely you do. Uh, and in. And in Neath. Thanks so much for the raid. How was your stream? I appreciate it. Alright, let's go to Kaled. But yeah, DS3, they made, they made like a, an insanely good DS3 mod. And, uh, they're doing the same in this game. And this game's so much bigger, right? So it's... The mod's going to take a lot more work, and it's probably going to be much better, too, which I've already seen, Like, if you... I've been watching Couch. He does a lot of uh, playtesting on the mod on his stream, and so I've been watching stuff. I don't want to, like, I don't want to get spoiled too much on it, though, but I have been watching some things. It looks pretty sweet. Oh, wait, I'm supposed to be using spells here. Whoops. <laughs> Reset, dude. Yeah, runs over. I can't believe you've done this. Oh, yeah, the Gideon kill was pretty sweet, dude. I it, Like, part of me, though, is a little... I'm a little upset that I saw it. I don't know why I graced back here, but... I will not spoil what the Gideon kill is, but it's it's pretty fucking sweet. Or the Gideon, the Gideon boss fight in the mod is really cool. And yeah, he was saying that all, all the all the starting classes start in different areas in the game. And they each have kind of their unique progression of how to get all their stuff set up. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm not sure when they're planning on having the alpha released, but...
I don't know if they posted anything on YouTube. They did. They do have like a Twitter account, I guess, though. I I did hear about that Opa. Yeah. Is that actually real? But for sure, when that, whenever that comes out, we're going to play it. I play the mod, the, the Converge mod? Not yet. Like, whenever it comes out. Take on the Beast Torch. This run's taking a little bit longer than I uh, anticipated. Can't wait for High Rock. Yeah, surely that'll <laughs> release in our lifetimes. I don't know why I just grabbed that. Surely. Same with Skywind and Sky Oblivion. The leak? Was there a leak? I I don't remember that. Lost the square to Aggie after failing that skip. And and did Aggie do the skip? Okay, finally we got it. So we should probably go upgrade first. What what do we upgrade it to? On the way to on the way to Godskin Duo, we can get the other somber bell bearing. So we're probably fine to get this to like plus seven, right? Let me just think. What which um which bell bearing is that? So one, two, three, four, five, six is from mountaintops, and then seven, eight, right? So we can get a plus eight. So yeah, we can get this basically just as much upgrade as we can here. I mean, even a plus nine is fine. All right, plus nine it is. Here we go. Dude, yeah, DS2 remake would be awesome. Wait, what? Did I not get the... No. Surely I remembered the grace up here. Oh, I... oh it's blocked. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I didn't see it because my like, camera is blocking it. All right, there we go, dude. A plus nine. That's not bad. <laughs> Taco Bell, Prius ad, and a Marines ad. Sounds pretty normal to me. Oh, 100%, Sagan. Yeah, they, they definitely... I, I honestly, I would not complain if they made a DS2 remake if Bluepoint made a DS2 remake in, like, the same engine as the Demon Souls one, I wouldn't really complain. Although, I don't know. I don't know. Because, the, like, the way DS2 feels is it's unique, right? But it's not, like, a bad thing. I, it, you know, it might lose some of the, some of the DS2-ness if they switch the engine, and maybe that's not a good thing. I don't know. Uh, I am still in the Bringo Brawlers thing, yeah, but it shouldn't it shouldn't last much longer. So. But 
But yeah, I was saying earlier though about you know when we were watching the Zero Hit League earlier, there were so there were no playoffs in Zero Hit League. There were um, seventeen match days. I, right, it was 17? I don't know. And I was like, at the time, I was like, you know, it, it would make this more interesting if there was a playoffs. Or, yeah, I guess 18. Yeah, yeah. Because there, there were 10 players in it, I guess. Anyways. So, yeah, I was like, at the time, I was like, man. It would probably be better if there was a playoffs after, because then... What ended up happening is that I ended up clinching the win of Zero Hit League with probably like four or five match days left. So it wasn't like battling until the very end and playoffs do make it so that it's like, you know, there's competition after. So nobody just like is a shoe in for the win or something or just clinches wins early. But at the same time, I don't like now, now that I'm doing like the bingo league, I don't know if I like playoffs, man. I almost prefer just like the, the normal regular season because it's kind of just less almost less of a commitment I guess you know I don't know I guess we'll see I, I we haven't even done any matches yet but it's almost like it's going on too long now or something I, I don't know we'll see But what's nice about the regular season is that like it's or if you if you don't have any playoffs, you just kind of um you kind of have in your mind when it's going to end and so you're just mentally prepared and it's like okay, at this date it's over and there's not any continuing on past that point. But in playoffs like it's like okay, do I do I make the playoffs? Do I play another round? Do I not? Like do I have to like free up time for this now? So there's some stuff I didn't consider about it. Consider being less good <laughs> so it's competitive. Well... Um... No, I guess not. Could I have winning the cup? I have no idea. Probably, uh... I'll just pick Boston, dude. Gonna melt once again? I hope so. I've... Like, they've actually... It's actually insane, that series, because they... Um, they've been the worst team in three of the four games and are up three to one. It's just wild, dude. It's not too often you see that, I feel like, in the playoffs. At least not that I've seen in the past however many years of watching it. Like, sometimes, sometimes, like, you'll get a few steals in the playoff run or something, which, like, you kind of have to get at some point, but... It's an okay amount of damage. Actually, a very big charger, too. But yeah, like, good goaltending. Like, it's goaltending, dude. 100%. Vasilevsky's been very, like, below average, I would say. Wow, that's a huge hit, dude. Is that a bleed proc or something? And, like, Samsonov hasn't been great, but he's been good enough, I guess, right? And it's, it's not, it's not good, dude. I don't know if, I don't know how Tampa's gonna be able to come back. They gotta win three in a row, dude. It's not good. But, I don't know, the way the way that Toronto's been playing, it seems like they're probably just going to get steamrolled by, <laughs> by Boston next round, so. If they do win, somehow. But, obviously, they are literally known for losing three-game series leads and, like, just 
at the drop of a hat, so. But yeah, they, they would have to play much, much better against against Boston. Like like I said, like they, they've been the worst team this series so far. At least based off of what I've seen. They have been the inferior team. Oh boy. I'm a fan of this charger too, man. Oh, really? Of course, the Fire Giant hitbox, the worst hitbox of all time. What's what's the series at right now, Geo? Is it is it two two now or is it still two one? Are they playing tonight? This weapon's okay, I guess. I don't know. It's it's hard to say when you're just fighting Fire Giant, and that's literally the only boss they're going to use it on. So, I'm rooting for Seattle as well, to be honest. Yeah. Dang, dude, 2-2. Two, two. All right, so for Farm Azula, we're going to use what? What did we say? Anyone but the Leafs? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I agree with that. Old Knight Winnipeg. Um, what is it? 3-1 right now? Uh, that's about as I expected, to be honest. And then, like, literally their best defense defenseman got hurt. And then didn't Wheeler also get hurt or something? Or Shifley? Like, one of... I don't remember which one. So, it's probably not looking good. I did pick up Seppuku, though. So, maybe we can go into Gelmir and then pick up the Scavenger. What do you guys think about that? Scavenger Curse Sword for Godskin Duo and... Malekith? Yeah, I saw, I, I've seen that actually, uh, Geo. Yeah, dude. There's still lots of time left, I guess, though. Pick it up. Yeah, we don't even have a region lock command, I don't think. Oh, just kidding. Oh, yeah, I, for I forgot Ozzy made that. Except that's the that's like the all bosses region lock rules, though. Better than Bandit Curve Sword? I actually have no idea. No idea. <coughs> uh, we are at six, 73 Arcane. I think we, we can use the Eleanor pull blade for the, the final four bosses or three bosses or whatever. Probably what I'll do. Request change? I no, we're just I, I just wanted to switch up the builds every region just to make it more fun. Also, why did I decide to go this way? Oh my god. Why did I go this way? Not paying attention.
But it's probably not faster for me to go back at this point. I do play on controller, yeah. So, I guess we're going to be able to get the scavenger sword to plus 19. I did pick up all the bell bearings, I think, so. Let's go on Jalen. It's been a really long run so far, dude. It's kind of been longer than I anticipated. It's going to be like four hours almost, dude. Only just killed Fire Giant. Yeah, Eleanor's the duel. It's a, it's a twin blade. A lot of these weapons I've never used before, though, so that's cool. Like, basically, most of them, right? The claws I've used, but... I I haven't used this before. I haven't used... Uh, the axe, either. Ripple Blade. I haven't used, really, the Reduvia before, either. Oh, you can make a request with channel points. These are requests from a charity event I did, like, a few months ago. I, I can't believe how, like far away I went, or how far the wrong way I went, dude. It would have been so much faster to just climb the ladder back there. Uh, what's the what's the weapon I used in this region? I guess it was the Ripple Blade. I, I, I'll just kill this guy. Fairly no problem. Nice rock. Look at that. Beautiful hitbox. Okay, there we go. Q. If you do uh, exclamation mark charity, um, you should be able to scroll down and see a big list of stuff. It, like the, the the list is huge and it's probably going to take a long time to get through it. So I'm not planning on doing all of them today or anything like that, but we'll do some. Okay. Yeah. So that should be a plus 19. Should be good. Nate bleed. I guess the question is, is it better for us to go with, um... Divinity. Oh, I didn't want me doing much. Just lay out. Seppuku, or... Seppuku, or do we go with, like, Blood Flame Blade? Need a new no-hit rando run? Yeah, we could do one of those pretty soon. What do you guys think? What's up, uh, Jgiv? What's going, dude? Let's go Seppuku. Oh, that's a lot of bleed build up, man. All right. Into Far Missoula. And I guess we should get more arcane. 69 arcane. I wonder if in the DLC they're going to add some sort of arcane talisman and arcane tier.
We could go get the occult whetstone, I guess. Dog on stream? I, I surely already did that. My dog's been on the stream numerous times. Yeah, I think a cult is technically better, but I mean, it's okay. What's up, John? Snowmobile dog? No, actual dog. Consumables that give stats? I mean, we kind of have that though, right? The physic does that. It's like a mini version of that. There's actually a stronger version of that, actually. I don't I, I, I don't think we need more buffs for our stats. <laughs> I really don't. I think we're good. More perfumes would be really cool. I would like to see a black flame pot as well. That does like that 2% damage. That'd be kind of cool. Although, maybe not that useful now that I think about it. Unless it, unless it hit multiple times, like Black Flame Tornado or something. Yeah, Black Flame would be cool. Like, yeah. Black Catch Flame. You, you should be able to make a farm, dude, in this game. Where you can plant all of those, like, hard, those limited consumables. The Trina's Lilies and stuff. You should be able to make, like, a fucking house and, and a farm. <laughs> you get to plant the consumables, dude. That'd be sweet. It's literally just like the Hearthfire DLC from Skyrim. Yeah, I would buy that so fast, it'd be insane. We'll pick up these somber stones if we're going to go with uh, the pole blade after this. Gra uh, gravel seal. Isn't that strength? Like the... I don't know. I thought there was a strength one. All right, let's see. Uh, do I have sleep? We should maybe consider sleeping. Yeah, what? Yeah, that, that's the Garonk one is the one I was thinking of. What is that one? Oh, the the beast seal or something. Well, you're back. Goodbye. I mean, I play on controller, Jay. All right, here we go. This should be good. There's no reason why this shouldn't be good here. Oh boy. Oh, oh my God. I guess I just realized that I don't have Gambit or anything. What a horrible setup I've gone with here. Hello? You're really not in that? Oh, you are so annoying. It's insane. Oh, you didn't dodge. Okay. I just realized we have a million blue flasks and not a lot of non-blue flasks. Look at that bleed. You bastard.
by Seppuku. Get stunned, asshole. Yeah. <laughs> what, a, what a great timing on the stun. Perfect. Beautiful. All right, now we simply get a... I could get a plus 25. So I guess I should. Uh, we are plus 19. Uh, you wait, so the reason why you wait after killing the noble is so that, like, basically, if you wait a certain amount of time after killing the noble to kill the apostle, then you'll guarantee that you get the noble to spawn in again, which is what you want. Because the noble is just a lot easier to deal with than the apostle. The apostle is just an asshole. What's up, Zodiac? I'm pretty sure there were, like, several all-bosses runs that people, uh donated for during the charity run, so those runs are going to take a while. Hopefully there's, there's some like region lock runs in there too. I guess we can just make it region lock, I guess. If I want to. Infant head all bosses? There's not. That's a lie. Surely that's a line. There's no way it was all bosses. <laughs> There's no way, dude. That's actually going to take forever. Okay, well... Well, two hundred dollar donation doesn't necessarily mean it was all bosses. Like, someone could donate two hundred dollars and not request an all bosses run. At least it's for charity. Yeah, I maybe, guess that's true. Maybe Although maybe the, best the charity already got the money, so <laughs> all these runs are. This is going too far. Just simply raise for charity and then ditch. Just never do it. Uh, Mechlo, thanks for the, um, uh, burning prime sub, dude. I appreciate that. I guess I should go get the somber 10 down here. Although, kind of feeling lazy, dude. I'd rather just get the somber in Ashen Capital. Uh, right now, this is a scavenger cursor. We'll, we'll see what the request says. We will see. I, I don't actually know if you can just sneak past this guy here. Infant head, it's like a, it's a infinite consumable that just sprays water on the ground and it's horrible. It's really, really bad. You get it in a, in a weird area that I didn't even know existed for a long time. Um, in, it's in, it's in Nokron, uh, maybe, next to, maybe. I'll give you the uh, best not ever. like on the upper part. This is going too far. I would assume it scales with something, yeah. Probably. Sully, thanks for the brand new sub, dude. Appreciate that. Yeah, next to the Red Wolf, yeah. Alright, here we go.
Yeah, if it, if it does magic damage, I guess you could probably stack, uh, like, Terra Magica and stuff with it. So, who knows, man? Maybe it could be good. Probably not, though. Surely I'm not going to get lightning blasted out in here. Nice bleed. Oh, rip the stun. Whoops. At least Epiku won't run out here. Why did I say anything? What have I done? Yeah, this this weapon's pretty insane, dude. That's so much bleed build up. And Subaku is such a good buff in this game. There was actually a weapon in Dark Souls 3 that had this buff. Exact same buff. Um, and it was honestly not good. It was okay, but it wasn't anything special. I don't think it even added bleed. Or anything like that. It just added physical damage. And it was okay, but it wasn't like this. Alright, we'll go with the Elinor's Bull Blade for the last uh, weapon, dude. Let's go retrieve that. 20% damage boost on the antlers. The antlers, really? Like, is it specific to that item? What's up, uh, Zato? It's going pretty well so far. Yeah, bleed, bleed was definitely not as good in DS3. It was, it was more balanced, right? It was still good, though. Like, you, it was still good. But it wasn't great. All right, shall we do this cheese? I think so. I think we should. Oh yeah, we're gonna do probably, we're gonna do quite a few runs today, I think. Uh, I guess I normally drop here. Oh. Can't believe this. Clearly, clearly, I haven't done this for a while. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Not what you like to see. Oh, uh, where do you get that weapon from, uh, on Vela Sense? Oh, Halley Tree. Does it make sense? Jump Maze, the Blade of Gravity. Imagine if they actually had difficult parkour in this game. <laughs> you could, like, easily fall down. Or, or, or a boss where, uh... Okay, is th this is... Okay, then here we go. A boss where, um... It's like moving platforms or something like that. That'd be awesome. 
People would hate it so much. Okay. Let's go on uh, Martel. Place of the three fingers count? I guess no, because you're not you're not like you're just falling. So I, I like I guess sort of, but Okay, and then our last somber we will get from here. Uh, I don't even know what the weapon that is, uh, Sultan. Is that... Like, the Cincadilla? Is that, is that what you mean? Or is that something else? How many hours? Like, around 2,000, I think. <laughs> Cicada these nuts, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. But no, I haven't. I haven't done a run with that. Is it good or? No, 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 no. Don't aggro. Oh, is, is it actually decent? Okay, here we go. Plus 10 Eleonora's Pull Blade to finish off the game. I probably should go get, like, Ritual Sword and stuff, but... I'm... Maybe I should, dude. I probably should. Let's go grab it. 10% more damage is not bad. True, we could get the... Yeah, that's it. We could definitely get the... Um, wing Sword Talisman, too. Yeah, let's go grab it. That's a good idea. Okay. And then... Go here. Lord of Bloods. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I should have gotten that a while ago, actually. Not it, like that. That Talisman's not very good on these final bosses, though. It's good on Gideon, but not the other ones. Just two of them can't bleed, and then one of them's mega resistant to bleed. So maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. Melon King, thanks for the twenty-one month resub. This is going too far. Thanks so much, dude. Congrats on the one hundred k. Why didn't that lobster jump out there? What's the goal? It's just we're beating the game with only leveling arcane. Yeah, I wonder how long it'll take for them to send me the, the play button, dude. Kind of insane, dude. 100,000 is a lot of people. Well, no, the claws, the claws we just, I'm using them for Lyurnia. Like, I've, I've been changing my build every single region. And then when I've, when I've gone back to the regions, I've just used the same build. So. 
I really don't like this enemy. I still didn't buff with Blood Flame. Bleed? Somewhere? You have to bleed? Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. This is going too far. Oh. Supplement, thanks for the two month resub. Welcome back. Here we go. All right, so now we got a setup here. Set up for Gideon. Thanks, Spiral. And how's it going to Souza as well? Is there a list? Yeah, if you do exclamation mark charity, there's like a... And you scroll down a bit. Should get the stuff. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the This has a pretty horrible ever. charger too, though. Compared to some of the other twin blades. This is going too far. Oh, Melissa? No, I, I didn't. I'm, I'm sure just the one will be okay. Happy Tio, thanks for the brand new Prime sub as well. Thanks, dude. Charger 2 multi hit? It does multi hit, yeah, it hits a bunch of times. But it's just like the weird charge up at the start is not really what you're looking for. But yeah, it does hit it quite a few times. I wonder if this will be enough to just like script maybe, Gideon, man. Maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. A blehu. This is going too far. <laughs> uh, thanks for the two month prime sub, dude. Hopefully, I said that right. I probably didn't, but. Thanks, dude. Stand before the Elden Ring. All right, here we go. To become Elden Lord. What a sad um, how should we do this? Oh, get out, Space Gideon! Oh my God! <laughs> get destroyed, dude! This is going too far. Jeez. That fucking outspaced. Not even you. A man. Wow. Blasted. Catharsis. Thanks for the brand new Prime sub as well. How's it going, Casey? Welcome back, man. That was pretty satisfying. <laughs> Just like perfectly outspacing his swing. Experience of people who think getting an easy boss. That's that's true, yeah. It's like blast him right away. Is this Eleanor's pull blade? It's a cool weapon. I did do a no hit run with it a while ago. It was actually it was the final weapon of the 40 run requests. Like the 40th no hit. That's a lot of arcane. Descaling arcane. I can't believe we got the squid helmet on this run. 0.5%. In Altus, I used the, uh, what's it called? The weird axe. Wow, nice bleed, dude. Dang. Oh my god, the style is just so insane, it's kind of crazy.
No, you don't. Dang, dude. That's insane. Oh, the bleed is... Yeah, I mean, with almost 99 arcane, we're definitely <laughs> procking that bleed a lot faster. That's for sure. This weapon's also good on Radagon because of the fire damage, too. Dude, this is some serious damage. Done. Whoops. Oh no. Blasted. I thought. But I thought I was a beast. Uh, the throwing knife, I, I, I think you can maybe hit him with it, but... The purpose of hitting him during that is just to upkeep poise damage, which is a strat I used on some of the no-hit runs. But usually I'd use Mighty Shot. Oh boy. Okay, no, I'm good. One part about that that's actually really cool about this weapon is that you... Oh my god. You have like the built-in uh, 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 like back step to get out of range of the uh, attacks of the boss after the combo. There we go. No problem. <laughs> built-in. <laughs> Built in, dude. Who's built in? Uh, I have Antizar. Nice, dude. All right, a request done. Navinate twenty dollars to American Heart Association. I appreciate that, even though it was from like three months ago. Okay, so Bebo requested an Ice Rhine Hatchet, no hit any percent, which, like. I'm not going to do that for this, but I could do it for, like... I'll make an exception. We can do it when we do the no-hit requests. Um, 
me see what else there is. We'll just like add it to the no hit request because I'm going to do all those in a row, sort of like I did last year at the end of last year. Um, So we can just throw that in there. Okay. Jimmy meme run all merchants. So I think the idea is just we kill every single merchant. Let me just think about that for a second. The fallen leaves tell a story. Who requested this, Jimmy? Of how a tarnished became Elden Lord. Here we go. In our home, across the fog, the lands between. <laughs> I'll boss run, but I'll boss our merchants. What would be a fun one, fun way to kill the merchants, dude? Oh yeah, we gotta do we gotta do sewer mog merchant or, or not sewer mog. Uh, the Mogwin Palace merchant. Use weapons that they sell. <laughs> like like buy the weapon and then kill them with their own weapon. I guess we could do that. Do they all sell weapons though? Elden Lord achievement unlocked. Do the skip for Mountain Toss Merchant? I guess I get. Yeah, so how far in the game do we have to progress? We don't have to kill Fire Giant. We don't have to get into. Uh, D, uh, we don't have to get into. Into where? Halig Tree. I don't know. I have to go to, go to the bathroom. I'm also going to get a drink. Um, and I'll, I'll, you know, we can think about this run. You guys can think about how we should do this run while I'm gone. But I will be back in a few minutes, you guys.